follow this step-by-step -step installation guide to install your new Grower product easily. You will find the following items in your package. You will need the following tools and accessories for assembly. Before dismantling your old unit, identify the hot and cold water, then shut off the water supply. Prepare parts and tools with close access to the connections. Take out the installation instructions, be sure to store them after installation. Pick up the basin mixer and watertight seal. Place the seal on the basin and insert the hoses into the mixer hole on the basin. Place the mixer tap so that the watertight seal is in contact with the basin. Hold the mixer in this position. Hint, use the hoses to hold the mixer firmly until it is attached. Take the tightening shim and its nut. Now slide the locking nut along the threaded rod, positioning the seal towards the unit, then hand tighten the nut firmly. Release the basin mixer, which is now held in place, and check its proper orientation. Adjust it if necessary. Hold the basin mixer and use a 13mm socket wrench to tighten the nut without forcing hard enough to damage the ceramic. Pick up the plug hole. For water tightness, apply a sealing compound or silicone around the plug hole, then insert it into the basin's drain hole. Take the drain and its seal. Place the joint above the drain. Hold the plug hole in place and screw the drain down onto the threaded part of the plug hole, making sure to orient the drain axis towards the back. Check tightening to avoid any risk of leaks. Insert the drain actuator at the back of the mixer. Pick up the rod. Screw the rod onto the drain actuator. Pick up the connector. Insert the connector through the extender, then through the drain axis. Check the low positions of the drain axis and actuator and screw on the connector using a small Phillips head screwdriver. Make sure the drain actuator operates properly. Pick up the plug. Use the drain actuator to make sure the plug closes completely. If not, remove it and unscrew the lock nut. Use an adjustable wrench to turn the adjustment screw, then tighten down the lock nut with a 10mm spanner. Again, make sure the plug closes completely. Use a metal saw to cut off the excess part of the extender, which could interfere with the drain. Connect the drain to the siphon, then make sure the seals are properly in place and tighten. Make sure seals are present in the hoses. If not, add a fiber or rubber seal. Screw the left-hand hose onto the hot water faucet 
and the right hand hose on the cold water faucet. Tighten with a 19mm open end wrench. Make sure there are no kinks or bends in the hoses. Turn on your water supply to the basin mixer tap. Make sure everything is watertight. Make sure mixer is operating properly. Congratulations!